What is up YouTube? Tim here and I'm going to do a little video here and I'm not going to waste your time by doing the unpackaging and all that but anyway package right here and what was in it? Well first of all just want to show you this the sticker rock out with your Glock out speed is fine accuracy is final and that is from VickersTactical.com Vickers being Larry Vickers of course if you watch the Sportsman's Channel channel 6 on 605 on direct tv uh there's what is on thursdays they do lock and load thursdays uh all guns and stuff and i know i think he was on used to be on handguns tv and now he's got his own show called uh tactical arms anyway he's ex-special forces and all that but vickers tactical along with tango down has a a glock extended mag release now, what makes this different than your aftermarket Glock or Glock uh, extended mag release or just regular mag, mag release for that matter is the sharp edges that it has. Now, if you notice on the, uh, sorry, the uh, Vickers Tactical or the Tango Down, those sharp edges on each corner are rounded off. If you can see a little bit there on that, that back, or that uh, white backdrop. But anyway, a lot of people complain about the uh, regular Glock mag release being very sharp and digging into your skin, which I guess it could do. Some people complain about it. It doesn't bother me, but I figured I'd order it and see how it does. So, let's get to it. Yes, loaded Winchester Supreme Elite uh, PDX-1 bonded jacketed hollow points, 180 grain, or 165. Heck, I can't remember. Let's just get on with the video. All right, there is not one in the chamber. Put your slide off to the side. And let's see if we can do this while looking through the viewfinder. Can you see the uh, little spring down there? Right there, long metal, shiny metal thing. Okay, I've got to move that out of the way. Pull it out like I did right there. If you can see it's on top of the blade of the uh, screwdriver. And that just kind of pulls it out of the old groove in the old mag release. And the old mag release just simply slides out. See, there's the old one. And you can see the uh, how sharp those edges are. And people complain about that. And they are. If they were actually touching your skin, they could dig in. So there's the old one. Now let's see if we can uh, get the new one in. you got to move the spring out of the way. And I haven't done this just many times, so bear with me on this. So, let's get the uh, Tango Down one. Sportsman Channel, I love that show. And, you know, on other days of the week, they do fishing or, you know, things with archery or all kinds of good stuff. Now, the tricky part to me is getting that spring back up so you can slide the new one in. And pain in the ass. But trying to do it while well, looking through a viewfinder is a real bitch. Now, yeah. that slipped out. I had it. You know, when you got the camera rolling, sometimes it just doesn't work out the way you want it to. But that's my luck. Alright, that little blade there may be a little too thick. Let's try a longer or a thinner one. See if we can get under there good. Get that out of the way. And of course, there we go. It is in there. You can see the spring riding on the top of the new mag release. Now you got to push that spring back over. And I don't know if the reflection is going to show you a little groove, but there's a little groove on that mag release that that spring has to go back in. And I'm trying to get an angle here where I'm not knocking over the camera. There it goes. It has popped back into place. <coughs> there is the Tango Down uh, Vickers Tactical Extended Mag Release. And I hope that's focusing alright. This is the Blackberry Torch, as some of you know. And uh, I uh, got some good comments about the video quality and the sound. It's a lot better than the iPhone. 
but there we go. Let's give it a little test. Pop the old magazine in just see if it works real well. Yep, what do you know? Good stuff. Put the slide back on. And there you have it. In there. Looking good. One more look real quick, guys. And that may not be an extended. Yeah, it is extended. Or is it? Can't tell. Holding it. How's it feel? Nope, that's not extended. That's just regular. That's okay. I only had the other extended one in there. Basically just seeing what it does and making a video kind of showing uh, my old video, Glock 27 mag extended mag release install or mag release install just showing you how how it worked and as you can tell here I've got the gap uh, finger rest extensions and I'm gonna do a video on those uh, maybe tomorrow or the next day but yep looks good It's definitely not sharp no pain when you dig into it outstanding that's great and the other side you know it's in there flush looks good and that's how we do it. All right, guys. Simple enough. And then, uh, you can go to Vic VickersTactical.com to order this. Uh, they are made by Tango Down, and it comes with you know some instructions in case uh, you're not sure how to remove it and put them back in. Right through here. Good stuff. And they got here extremely, extremely quick. And that was the uh, round I had in the chamber, and I'll put that back in in just a little bit. All right, guys. Hope this helps you a little bit. Uh, anyway, if you want to see a video getting down in there, how to take it out a little better than this one, go to the uh, my Glock 27 extended mag release install. All right, guys, take it easy, and I will see you later.